Hey thanks guys, welcome back to the Mill Social Talk Podcast. Last week we had a fabulous, fabulous guest on. We'll probably reference him. And uh, he, I mean, Freddie uh, did a great job last week. But anyway, we're, we're back this week. And we're following up guys because we wanted to kind of bring back Journey Forward. They were on last week. And so we want to bring them back to say, tell us a little more about this finance. I mean, you guys know, um, Karen and Anne Marie, and we have my partner on my right hand, Miss Gabriella. Hey. <laughs> you know, and um, and Liz, Liz, yeah. uh, we have we all work together. <laughs> but um, we want to come back and we want to talk about finances, right? Because you know, uh, you know, I, I'm a broker in most realty, and we're all in finance, and we all have people. So let's start again. We have um, Anne Marie, yes, Karen, Liz, and Gabby. So let's kind of get right into it because you know okay. we don't have a lot of time. Get, let's get into it uh, on on the finances side okay. on um, journey four. All right. And how you guys gonna put it together along with the bond bank? Because we're all kind of yeah. on team. Right? Well, we're the journey forward is super excited to yeah. be here again. Thank you so yeah. much to you and Mills Realty and our wonderful partner Devon Bank. Yeah. Um, so the journey forward, we are a HUD certified financial and housing counseling agency. And we are really committed to teaching the basics of money management, from understanding how to budget, which we really believe is the foundation of financial health. Um, you know, it's not really the most exciting topic for most people, but I promise you, your budget is your financial GPS. It'll get you from where you are today to where you want to be. It's an essential piece to really getting what you want to achieve in your financial life. We also talk a lot about credit, uh, we will pull your credit report, uh, try merge, it's a soft pull, take you through it line by line, help you understand what everything is being reported, what are the codes, what do they mean. If there's anything on that credit report that needs to be addressed or disputed, we can help you through that process. We also teach you a lot about the importance of being banked. Um, you know, and here we have our partners. Nearly 400,000 people in Chicago alone are unbanked, which is you know, a terrible statistic because A, how do you grow your money if you don't have access to the tools that a, a bank can bring you? Uh, but also these credit, these wonderful second chance banking and credit builder products. But not only is it that you don't have access to the tools, you're also very vulnerable to predatory lenders, payday loans, title loans, even currency exchanges. So if you're trying to grow your money, it's very difficult when you're paying exorbitant fees just to manage your money, to cash your checks. So we really talk a lot about the importance of being banked and accessing those tools that just give you a firmer financial footing to achieve your goals. And we talk about a lot of other important, relevant financial topics, such as protecting your identity, protecting your assets. But we also are housing counselors. We are very committed to every topic related to, counsel, to housing whether it's homeless prevention, uh, rental topics, how to read a lease, do you know your rights as a renter? Uh, we also uh, have the privilege of preparing people for home ownership in our pre-purchase program. We have our foreclosure prevention program, which we're participating right now in a wonderful grant with the Illinois Housing Development Authority, IDA, with their Illinois Homeowner Assistance Fund grant. It's called ILHAF, Illinois Homeowner Assistance Fund Grant. The portal opens November 1st. So for you, anybody who's listening, if it's not for you, for your sister, your brother, your mother, your friend, your cousin, your faith community, this grant provides up to $30,000 of grant assistance, money you do not have to pay back, for mortgage arrearages, for property tax arrearages, and homeowner association due arrearages. Um, so please know that that portal opens November 1st. We, The Journey Forward, are one of the housing counseling agencies that is partnering with IDA to provide this assistance so that people can access that help and stay housed. Um, so we're, we, we do so much with our clients. We will also help you access supportive services that can enhance your ability to achieve your goals, whether that's learning about rental assistance or doing a SNAP application for food assistance if you're food insecure, 
um, helping you understand how to access Medicaid or county care. Um, so we know about a lot of resources, whether it's low income energy assistance program, SNAP, rental assistance. We do everything we can to number one, help you reach your goals and to remain stably housed. So thank you for having us. My gosh, that's like a wow. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Too much. It is a, it is a wow. I, was, I have like so many questions. I was trying to grab the pen and okay, before I forget. So do you mind if I get, do you mind if I go, go, go I, ahead. Okay, okay. So I'm you, excited about you know, all saying, this. As she was talking time. like, I know. You've got so much yeah. shit you do. <laughs> and, and, you know, it's also as, you know, thank you, Freddie, so much for sharing your story. Yes. And I know that not only is the Journey Forward a great um, organization for financial assistance and everything that Anne Marie and Karen mentioned, but I also know that there's a lot of help, a lot of emotional and mental assistance where they can connect you with them, with somebody that can help you. So that it's seriously it's a one stop, right? We it just is gotta a one stop. call oh, them gosh. and and get information, whatever you need. Yes. Um, so thank you so much for sharing all of that. Yes. But I also wanted to mention for uh, for closure prevention, um, do you also talk to? I'm sure you do, but maybe we can just remind the audience yeah. about you know. So it's not only maybe you have to look at your homeowner's insurance. So maybe you have to look at, did you appeal your taxes? You have a homeowner's exemption. Those are a lot of little reminders that as homeowners, with all of our stress or our daily lives, you know, we can forget about that. So I'm sure that having another second set of eyes or just yeah, another yeah. person helping you look at that, oh yeah, that's right, I didn't, I don't have that discount for my home and, right. and, and car or whatever the case right. may be. So there's other things that you should look also um, into and that I'm sure you know it's part of the for yeah. closure prevention like yes. let's help them find out all this Absolutely. I know that even for student loans yes yeah. there was help in there mm -hmm. so I mean thank you thank you so much for sharing yeah. all that information so I was just too excited I need help questions I mean go, go, go ahead go on, yeah. I, well what I wanted to say is you know the journey forward we are fortunate to be able yeah. to mm -hmm. partner Very. with HUD and Ida um, and some private foundations and things, but one of the, you know, the, one of our cornerstones is um, our banking partners and the support that we receive from our banking partners. So I, just, I wanted to also mention that because we couldn't do right. what we do with people who, who come for assistance if it wasn't for banks like Devon Bank. Um, who you know That's provide true. the support that allows us as a nonprofit to keep doing what we're doing. So, thank you, thank you for your enthusiasm, yes. um, but, but also thank you for always keeping the journey forward um, and um, those that we serve um, in mind as you develop your products and you work, um, you know, with uh, with your clients. And, and I know that you've referred several over to us um, uh, for housing um, counseling. And May I share a success? Yes, yes we'd love for you to do. <laughs> we recently, we talked about it in last um, yeah, episode, so, yeah. but i um, like to mention one of our recent closings with yeah. Leroy also, and the journey forward. So we were all working together, yeah. all the yes. organizations. And she dream team. Dream team. Dream team. There you go. Dream oh, yes. team. <laughs> so um, our customer was looking for uh, home buying education and home counseling, yes. right? So she was able to obtain six thousand dollars through the down payment plus program um, through the federal home loan bank. Yes. And they required a certificate to be issued by a HUD. Um, certified housing. Certified housing. housing. Thank you. Yes. So and they were able to help her and I know it took a little bit of time yeah. but you know what she's happy she was able to get that money oh, I'm so, so that's something that you know you guys were part of it too so thank mm -hmm. you so much for that yeah. oh it was our pleasure she's moving in this weekend and yeah, yeah. She's yeah. 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 see this is that's this is what <laughs> makes this kind of work so so absolutely worth it and heartwarming to see someone I know exactly who we're talking yeah. about mm -hmm. who her dream was home ownership 
and she made it happen. And sometimes it takes a little bit of teamwork to make that happen for the people that we serve. And um, and we're just delighted to have been a part of that journey with her. So that that's just wonderful news. Yeah, I, I want to ask a question because uh, I, I <laughs> <laughs> no, no, that's okay. Keep talking. But explain this. You mentioned second chance banking. Yes, yes. Let's explain that. Yes. Let's explain that. And I know Elizabeth is going to help me a little bit on this. What are you guys? Well, well, the reality is we work with a lot of clients who come to us and, you know, they've had some difficulty with their banking. And for whatever reason, maybe they're in the checks system, which is like another reporting agency um, where they had a relationship with the bank and they made some mistakes. Um, or they can't get a bank account for another reason. Maybe they're completely credit invisible. And they come to us and they're looking for an opportunity to get banked. We know that it is a very healthy thing to have a relationship with a bank. It helps you access the tools that you need, not just to manage your money, but to grow your money. And um, thank goodness for banks like uh, Devon Bank that has wonderful second chance Uh, banking and credit products that help people who maybe can't get a traditional credit card. Why? Because they're credit invisible. For whatever reason, they have never established a credit history. Maybe they're young or maybe they're somebody who was recently incarcerated and they um, are released and they have nothing to show because of course what does a creditor do? They look at your credit uh, report and if you're a blank slate then you're a risk and you're not going to get those traditional credit products. So that's where the importance of the second chance credit and banking access is so critically important to so many of the clients that we serve. So Elizabeth, so, do you so want to yeah, go ahead. gonna talk about that one. Okay. So I'll, talk, I'll talk about the first part of that and then I'll yes. let Elizabeth take the second part. She has to participate too. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, um, well, I'm not sure, well, I know that there is a product, Bank On, through Bank On. Yes. And we are offering our Fresh Start Tracking nice. account. It's a nice name to it, too, isn't it? Fresh, Fresh Start. Yeah, yeah. Second yeah. Chance. Yes. There you go. It. So um, it is for somebody who, as Anne Marie mentioned, uh, maybe had trouble before with check systems. Um, so we don't, I don't have the specifics right at this moment, but it's basically a checking or savings account that allows you to cash your check, to deposit your check. Um, maybe a little bit of differences between between a regular checking account, let's call that. No minimum balance. No, no minimum right. balance. It's really a one right. Is it a fee base? It is. Do you think it's a fee base? Like monthly fee? No, 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 no. no. Oh, There's no, no monthly not fee. No. No, like not, not specifically for bank on. Okay. But um, so that's the product that we'll be having hopefully soon. We do have everything set up. We just need to have like their last reviews to it and we're good to go. That's but wonderful. By the time this air out, just give us a call and we'll make sure to, <laughs> yeah. we'll make sure to let you know you're, you're golden at this yeah. time. But um, I'll talk, I'll have it, um, I'll have Elizabeth talk about the secure credit card, credit card, a little bit of how it works, what needs to happen in order for you to obtain one. Hello everyone. <laughs> My name is Elizabeth. But before I start, I did really enjoy the... Last one. Oh yes. I love <laughs> that story from Freddie. Mm-hmm. And I was like, listening and then I'm like, you know, you know, this guy could have taken another route, but and that's a good example. You know why? Because he mentioned he still have friends that exactly. are there, yeah. so he would be that one person who's going to link everyone else to you guys, right? Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah, he's 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 a beacon of hope to his friends who are still yeah. Right. That's what I'm saying. He right, the right, right. and yeah. we're here to help them absolutely, but. To see somebody who's yes. made it yes. and who's so gracious yes. and generous, and I just have always go back to like I would have come out bitter. I'd have been <laughs> like, I am mad. Yes. Forget yes. everything. Yes. None of that. Yes. And and yes. we have the dream team all here. <laughs> we purchase counselors <laughs> to start with the credit, <laughs> your realtor to find a house, and your lender to get your loan. I mean, what else do you need? We'll We're all here. here. It, was, it was amazing, <laughs> and now uh, you know, just heard it. Don't know him personally like yeah. that, but it's just you know we're proud of, of him. Yeah, of everything he's, he's done, and yeah, in less than a year, I think it was it. And can years. I tell you one of my favorite? Freddie didn't share this um, in the last season's episode, but one of my favorite 
and I think I still have it on my cell phone. Actually, I'm sure I do. Yes. He left me a message, and he's like, I just want to thank you. I'm feeling so blessed. I'm in my own apartment for the first time ever in my adult life, and wow. I just prepared myself breakfast. And I literally get him a cup every time. I mean, I'm, like on the hard days, I'm like, I got to hear Freddie's like, you know what, let me walk out of the office. Give me a minute. Okay. No, that's amazing, because yeah. then it's not only yeah. business, it's a relationship. Yeah. Oh, right. it is. It's, it's a personal. friendship. It's, it becomes yeah. personal. It is. So that's amazing. I'm Absolutely. just happy. And I remember, I know, that, I don't know if it was mentioned in the last episode, but I, it was mentioned in an uh, event uh, for the Journey Forward where Freddie said, you know, there's a big difference between the Journey Forward and another. And everybody else. Oh, well, they Because so they were so, they, they answered my questions, they were personal, they knew me by name. I mean, you yes. know, so yes. it becomes that was, yes. that was. I just wanted to make that out. Okay, okay. <laughs> so, so moving on. Let's go ahead and second that. Right. So, we do have a secure card. Um, like you mentioned, we need to have credit. Right. So, this is, it helps to build or rebuild, right, your credit. Uh, there's people that, like you mentioned, maybe they never had credit before, they, um, or they did. I, I had personally had a secure credit card. Not because I messed it up. Someone else did it for me, and I had to start from zero again. Right. And I was like, oh, great. Now what am I going to do? My credit score is going to stop. It's uh -huh. ruined. And I, that helped because right now I'm okay. Like, I'm, I'm 800 score. Oh, you're and great. It, oh, yes. I, I'm, you and, and I had, back, you know, I have my father. You better pay everything on time. You do this. You do yeah. that. You know, so there are certain things that we have to do, too, um, in order to make this process even better and faster. So we do have the secure credit card. Um, Divan offers that we, you go either online or you could go to any locations. We have a location in uh, Glenview, Wheeling, and we have one in Chicago. Um, we open a checking account because we, Divan wants to establish a relationship with the customer. We are a community bank. Nice. And yep. that's what we want to do. We want to make sure that when you come in, we say, hey, hey, yes. how are you? You know, they know you personally. Yeah. yeah. Like when right. Leroy goes to my, hey, Leroy, hey. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what we want to do. We want to establish that relationship with the customer. And we have a free checking account. That's wonderful. That one, the same. No fees, no monthly fees. You don't have to have a, a required um, minimum balance. Minimum balance. Good. It's the same. And you open it with $100. Wonderful. So that would be like the first step. You know, we will have to open a checking or savings account. Um, we get a lot of people that, you know, it's hard for them to keep a balance because they're still struggling and dealing with learning. Yes. Yeah. So that would be a perfect uh, account to start. We have the savings as well. Once you open the account with uh, with us, we apply for a credit card. Um, we have this on the website. We can do it. If they go in person, they could have the banker, the personal banker say, you know what, now that we open the account, let's try to open the credit card. On our website, which is www.thebombbank.com, if you go under the personal and the credit cards, you are not going to see a tab that says secure credit card. Because we don't want to assume that you're not going to qualify for a regular credit card. Mm -hmm. right? So you apply for the credit card that you choose, that you like, and then once that happened, they come. The company will contact the bank and say, "Hey, you know, the six, this person has an account with you guys." They do. Okay, so they they qualify for a credit card. Fine, move on. If they don't, they'll let they let us know. They don't. They were not approved for a regular credit card, but they might be uh, um, eligible for a secure credit card. Mm -hmm. So that's when you know we do the communication with the customer, and then from there. If they decide that they want to do the secure credit card, then we go for it, and that's it's a great way to right. to a great yeah. avenue to start everything and the credit and help you with the that's with fantastic. the fantastic. credit. Yes. We, and, and something that I should mention is that we also offer um, this product for somebody who has an ITIN, somebody oh, yes. that doesn't have a social security yes. number, and ITIN is an individual tax identification mm -hmm. number. So somebody that doesn't have a social security mm -hmm. number but has an ITIN, we can open a checking mm -hmm. savings yes. account, mm -hmm. and we can also provide them with a secured credit card, credit card if they qualify. Could you explain a little bit just what is a secure credit card and how it differs from a credit card? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So the only one of the, 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 the which is, I'll say the difference will be maybe the name, secure credit card, because when it 
when you use it, it shows like a, a regular credit card. Mm -hmm. So, so are they are you credit or debit? You, it's you, a credit. It's, it's a credit because it's credit. reported to the oh, credit right. bureaus. Right. Okay. And, so, and in some cases, the client has to put the money on the so card. So that's what themselves. I was going to say. Right. So the secure credit card, that's what it is. I was going to say that now, but you asked. Yeah. So you you put the, the deposit out of your pocket. So you have the minimum of 300 to to $1,000. So whatever amount you choose to start with, mm -hmm. that's whatever you that's use. A credit, right? That's a credit. You deposit that money. You use your credit card. You make your payments on time. Right. You do not um, exceed, exceed <laughs> yeah. your limits. Right. And then once you're ready, that your credit score, it's you said, oh man, I'm like this high now. I don't need the secure credit card. Right. Once you're ready to transition to the credit card, the regular credit card, then you get the money that you deposit and you get it refunded. Right, it's your money back. And you know, for, for maybe everybody doesn't know that, how do you grow a credit profile, a credit score? You have to have open, active accounts that mm -hmm. are reported to the credit bureaus, Equifax, Experian, and TransUnion. And these secured credit products are that avenue to getting that reporting. And the most important factor of your credit score is paying your bill on time. Mm -hmm. And the second most important factor is that you don't carry too high of a balance. So this is what we do is we kind of take you by the hand as you are walking this journey of growing a strong credit profile. We help you access these wonderful tools and really educate you along the way. And we want you to make this part of the fabric of your financial culture not just for you, but for your entire family. Because we don't learn this stuff in school. Mm -hmm. I, no, no. I don't know why. Yes. And to me, you know, I personally feel like if your money's not right, there's not a whole lot in your life That's that right. can feel right, right? Mm -hmm. When you are under financial anxiety, it permeates every corner of your life. And we want you to have financial peace. And in order to do that, you must have knowledge. You must understand how to manage your money, just the basics. And I'll tell you, being successful is about your habits. It's not about how much money you make, because believe me, I work with people who make a lot of money, and they, they are broke, yeah, broke. Yeah, and they've got a terrible credit score. And then I work with other people who don't have a lot of money, but they've learned the skills yes, yeah. and they manage it beautifully. It's yeah. about your habits. Yes. So I love hearing about these tools that just make money management so much easier and accessible, accessible. to everyone. And that is what we need. Everybody should be able to have access to banking products and credit tools. So thank you to to, to your wonderful Devon Bank. It's wonderful. You know, Devon Bank has been a really good partner to me, you know. And so I, I love having, you know, I, I mean, I get to know a lot of you guys from Devon Bank. And when I walk by, hey, you know, and it's so personal, you know what I'm saying? It's so like, it's family. You know, when I walk in, it's, it's family, and I, and I like that. Yeah. I like it. I, I want to get back to... Um, when does that program end for the, that opens on November 1st? Is it, is it a time period? Yeah, yeah. 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 So it yeah. closes yeah. January 31st. Yes. So the we don't have a whole lot of we time. Don't. Yeah. No, the portal's we only open um, from November 1st to January 31st. Right. This is the second time. It was, uh, well, yeah. it was opened only f for 50 days earlier in the year, and um, they're reopening at uh, November 1st. Right. Um, um, it's, uh, it's, it's amazing. It's it, it right. is a great program. And, and, they've, and they've improved it the second time around. Number one, you can access assistance for property tax and for homeowners association dues, even without being behind in your mortgage, um, because they understand the vulnerability of that. Right? I mean, your home could be sold out from underneath you Absolutely. if you do not get current on these um, on these expenses. You do have to have a COVID-related financial loss. And the reality is, um, I think most of us most can of us find be, yeah. some COVID yeah. relation. So don't let that trip you up. Don't let that not make you call the journey forward for assistance. Because first of all, we're going to have a conversation with you. We're going to say what happened. Because we all know life happens, right? And if there's one thing that we must do, it's protect our biggest investment that most of us yeah. ever make in our life. And that's our home. Mm -hmm. And it's not just about an investment. It's where we lay our head down. It's where we raise our families. So we want to help you access this help. Don't self-eliminate. 
I talk to people every day who say, oh, Amory, I don't think I'll qualify. Mm -hmm. They qualify, they qual yeah. right? Mm -hmm. You know, oh, I lost my job because of this. I'm like, that is COVID related. Mm -hmm. So please don't self disqualify because here's the thing. Even if maybe you aren't a fit for the grant because not everybody is, we are still here for you. We will still connect with your lender. We will still explore options for you to avoid foreclosure. There are other things that you could try, a loan modification. There are many different opportunities that we can help um, educate you regarding you know, avoiding foreclosure. So please make that call, know that we're here for you, and um, even if the grant isn't a fit for you, we will still partner with you to help you save your home. I keep in mind this is the IDA program, so I mean, I mean, we're all in Chicago, so yeah. don't think. And, and, and of course, you know, uh, you know, I'm sure people listen to this podcast in many parts of the nation, mm -hmm. so you can still call the journey forward. Absolutely. Don't, don't, don't think because you're in California right. you can't right, call it. Right. Because California probably has their own. It, yeah. We're we're I mean, Illinois home. Yeah, we're Illinois home. So it, right, it, but there's well, probably California home. Probably there California are. home because right. it's it's the it's the it's federal program. It's a it federal, federal program. program. So, so to check in with your state. Exactly. You know, don't don't think that ah oh, you guys are in Chicago. Right. I, don't, right. I, mean, I, I know. help somebody in Indiana. I mean, I'm not formally, but I'm like this is the information. It's, there you go. Because they were right over the border. And I'm like, do you live in Illinois? Well, almost. And I'm like, well, what, still you can get the help through Indiana. We gave it. And, and that's what I want to say because you, right. because because uh, the the podcast goes not only in Illinois yeah. but all over. Wow. And, uh, <laughs> and so we want to be able to say, mm, you're famous. Call. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I mean, call them and they'll, I mean, call the journey forward. I'm sure they have some information out there in right. LA, New York. We have to listen to you. Know well, every state every has state. rolled it out differently, right. and yeah. every state is on, um, on like, a different on a schedule. Different schedule. Um, but we will certainly some help states connect never closed. Yeah, like yes. Illinois opened and closed, and now it's okay. reopening. Yeah. So it is very specific to your state. But to Leroy's point, you know, if, if you're in California, Indiana, Michigan, you know, make sure that if if you don't have access to look it up in your on your own. We will certainly help you find the information. Where did they call you? 312-429-5945. Or, or our website. Or our website. Which you, I, I think that's something you want to say. I mean, yes. I'm the time. Because oh, time is, oh. I mean, we, we, we go yeah. for five. Well, you were going to say something. Yes, I just had a quick question. So we talked about all of the services and all of the great um, tools that people can uh, talk to you guys about. But and is that a general number? Is it there is, a, is there number. more specific? So what do they do? Somebody calls and says, "I need help with my taxes," or do they say, "I need a pre-purchase counselor"? How yep, that, they, how you know, we we somebody answers the phone. We have uh, you know one person who answers all the calls. She will get you to the right person. We will call you back within 24 hours, probably sooner than that. Um, and we will then again have that conversation because a lot of times people call and they think they're calling for one reason. Then, mm -hmm. as we have that conversation, yeah, yeah. we're like, actually, yeah. you know what, you might be this. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. So you then you never know. And and so we, have, go ahead. Well, we also have a, a, a form on our website that you can fill okay. out. Right. Um, and again, yeah. within 24 hours, we'll okay. contact we'll the individual. And our website is thejourney-forward.org. Don't forget the dash. Yeah, you were going to say something yeah. before we wrap up? We do, I mean, talking about here in Chicago, we do have a lot of Hispanic people and um, Spanish speaking, yeah, because there's Hispanic speaking. <laughs> but what I mean is that you mentioned earlier, like, I me, mean, growing up, I didn't have none of this. Like, right. my parents didn't have it. Right. Mm -hmm. uh, we have a lot of people that only speak Spanish, but they are going through stuff like this. Do you guys have people that? We, we unfortunately don't, but the beauty of this is that Ida has many housing counseling partners, and the Spanish Coalition on Housing, they can also help you. Spanish okay. Coalition on yes. Housing. Yes, I said, guys, we're we running out of time. <laughs> we don't have enough time to do all this. But again, this is the Mill Social Talk podcast. We have the Journey Forward and Devon Bank. We're all partners together. We, we, we love having you. Please follow us, join us, uh, send send the podcast to wherever you, um, you don't need it, okay? Thank you guys again. And this again for another Thank episode you. of Thank you. Thank you. Mill Social Talk podcast. Thank you guys. Thank you.